have thought that I would have your life hanging in my hands. We're called. I mean, if this guy took Emma for the money, why hasn't he told us where to make the drop? He will. She's got to be patient. You have been, and what has it gotten you? Emma's been missing for days. You swept this place for bugs, right? I can speak freely? Yeah. You can't wait anymore. You have to go to the police. How is she? Her heart's beating. I'd say that's a marked improvement over yesterday. Thank you for saving my sister. Four, five, What's later? No hugs from you? Is she gonna wake up? My guess would be never. Don't say that. Slater asked a question. I gave an honest answer. Would you prefer I lie? She is going to wake up. She's already doing better. Her heart is stronger. Your sister's heart condition was a separate issue. Could she have died? Yes. Is it certain she'll wake up now that it's fixed? No. Kendall sustained severe head trauma. Add in the fact that it's not her first brain injury and the deck is already stacked against her. Now letting an incompetent Jake Martin tinker around in her skull during a power outage, that pretty much sealed the deal. Get out. David, I know how hard today must be for you. No parent should ever have to bury a child, let alone two. But taking out your grief on Zach, who's going through his own hell in there, isn't going to bring Babe back. Yeah, well, sitting vigil at Kendall's bedside isn't going to bring back either. What if the situations were reversed and it was Babe in that bed right now? Would you give up on her? Yeah, I didn't think so. I'll see you at the funeral. No, you won't. You're not going? No. That service isn't for Babe. It's for the Chandler so they can feel better about themselves for treating her like dirt. It's for the people who loved her to remember her. Her father should be there. the baby before the funeral. I'll be back very soon. I love you. The kidnapper will kill Emma. Paying the money is our only option. The longer we wait, the harder it will be for the police to find Emma. The more people you have looking out there, the better. No. Call Jesse. Let him help. Hello. 926 Old Mill Road, apartment number five. One hour. Come alone, drop the money inside the door, and leave. What about Emma? If the money's all there, you'll get instructions on where to pick her up. You will get your money, but not until we see Emma. Hello? Hello? Erica hired a specialist to take over Kendall's case, so she's gonna need all the details of how your son screwed up the operation. Can you do that? You know, if uh, the specialist that you're talking about wants details, she, she can ask me herself. And I will be delighted to explain to her that your wife came in with a severe skull fracture, with bone fragments embedded in her skull, causing swelling and hemorrhaging. And you know what this specialist will explain to you? That left untreated, your wife will have experienced massive brain damage and or she would have bled to death. As opposed to the full life she's leading now. And you want to hold a grudge or something, go ahead. Just leave my father out of it, okay? Your father is the chief of staff at this hospital. He's responsible. I am responsible for my actions, so why don't you just stick to pushing people down the staircase, okay? Do you, maybe you don't know this, but Taylor might not walk again. The money. Give it to him now, and this guy will never tell you where he's keeping Emma. Who says we need him to tell us? 
we get a tracking device no. and, we, and we put it with the money and, and we let him think that we're following his instructions but he leads us straight to emma and 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 what if this guy finds the tracking device before we can get to her ryan there are ways to make it blend in with the bag if it's done right the kid never won't even know it's there aiden can help look you have to put your feelings aside and talk to him like it or not aiden can help and where else are you going to find a tracking device as fast you won't go to the police you guys are gonna be okay? You gonna stay in your separate corners while I'm gone? We'll be fine. Ryan may buy this little act of yours, but I don't. I know the truth. You don't want Emma to come home at all. You want her dead. God, don't you people ever knock? door was open. The nurse just got through telling me I needed to rest and then she let you in. I just want to let you know how sorry I was about what happened and, and um, for you not to worry about medical expenses, um, physical therapy, it's, it's all taken care of, okay? You're gonna throw money at the problem and it'll fix it? Thereby relieving you of your guilt and responsibility? What is it about men like you? Rich, powerful man, you make a phone call and boom, we're in a war. Only you don't give a damn about the grunts on the ground fighting it, do you? Don't worry about me. Fought that war, I'll fight this one. Your wife is the one fighting for her life. What are you gonna do about that? You're gonna cut a check to God to bring her back? Make a phone call? Here's what you can do for me, Mr. Slater. You can take responsibility for your situation, and I'll do the same. If I wanted Emma out of the way, why would I put up $8 million to get her back? Because you want to look good in front of Ryan. You want to make it seem like you give a damn about his daughter, our daughter. But I know what it really is about, Greenlee. You're jealous. You can't be serious. I had a life. With Ryan, we had a family, which is everything you always wanted. But you couldn't stand to see us happy, so you've been going around trying to convince everybody that I am crazy. When in reality, guess what? There really was a stalker trying to grab my daughter, and now Emma is out there, and she's scared, and she's alone. We'll find her. Get away from me. Get away from me. Why, why are you even here, Greenlee? You got everything you wanted. You got Ryan back. Are you just here to rub it in my face? Just, just go, okay? I mean it, get out! Fine. I'll wait for Ryan in the hall.